breakfast and we're just heading out to some places it's about an hour drive from our campsite we're going to a place called universe de poet ferrilu <laughs> don't know how to pronounce it but it basically means workman workman's of a junk man junkyard poet something like that anyway and then we're going to a insectarium de Lizio, which is a, a bug aquarium basically so we're going to the junkyard place first and it's basically a, a, a museum full of junk. fascinating mechanical models a bit like ch ch chitty bang bang cars and stuff like that if you've heard of ch ch chitty bang bang and then the bugs is just like a, a fish aquarium but a bug aquarium to see lots of different sort of bugs end up waking up till what time are we at half ten half past ten well, so, you're lucky, yeah <laughs> sat next to John's foot. I tried to get it on camera but I was too late and already ran off. And what noise were it making, John? No, <laughs> yesterday he said the noise were going go, 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 uh, like that. I was like, what the hell is that? <laughs> and then John, John shot up and you're like, what that? What's that? I was like, well, what's this guggling down at me foot? I looked down, it was massive. It was like, it's big. It's like, Jesus Christ, junk. it's an armadillo. Oh, it's a hedgehog. <laughs> a big French massive hedgehog. <laughs> funny. That looks funny doesn't it? Yeah. We've arrived at Le Univers de Poet. Hey look at that. That looks good. Doesn't it? Yeah. You like that? Yeah. Shall we go see some more? Come on then. Oh, you see the donkey? Yeah. Don't climb up, buddy. Oh, it looks well cool here. There's some geese. They're big, aren't they? Yeah, it looks good here, doesn't it? I like geese have got real skinny necks. Shall we go walk around? That's like the hole. Eh? Come on then, let's go. Wow. That looks fantastic. Wow. Wow. That looks good, doesn't it? I bet it took him ages to build these. Oh, it's got a lot of marble that's coming up now. That's clever, isn't it? You press that one then? Oh, it's a cloth. That's a good cloth. <laughs> These models here are so cool. They've all got little buttons that you can press here. Elliot's just pressed one there. Look at them. They're all handmade as well. Yeah. Every single one of them is handmade. I'm in my element. I am. It's absolutely all. brilliant. Wow, well, Elliot, do you like them? What do you think of that one there? Um, I don't know. You don't know. They're absolutely awesome. Everywhere I look, they're just models everywhere. Look amazing. Let me show you this one. Press this little button. Whee! bike <laughs> it looks awesome there's so many cool little models here that he's made all by himself I'm really glad we came here now
good that we went to so thank you so much to my mum for Fine recommending enough. it and finding it it was really good to see all the different machines and little things they'd made with a little goat over there in the field oh mm -hmm. yeah there's some more geese they're a lot smaller these ones that geese is tied up <laughs> we we stopped off at a little picnic place just to eat our dinner that we brought and now we've just arrived at the book place so I'm hoping this is really really good as well because this is one that my mum recommended. We are here. It took four minutes to go down the road and that's it. So it wasn't far at all. So we've literally been in the car for four minutes. But it's really nice. But it's absolutely boiling. But let's see where the bug place takes us and see if there's a really good things there. Wow, they're massive. Really big. Can you see them? They're really big stick insects. Oh, look at these here. Auntie Rachel had some of these ones. Wow. Wow, look at him. Are they the scorpion one? He's a big one. Oh, he is? Yeah. Oh, is it clear? Just there. I don't know if you can see there. Stick insects. Wow. What's that? Trapped by an ant, <laughs> whatever it is. Look at bad. these be beehives, John. They're massive. <laughs> yeah, that's a beekeeper. Oh, look, look. Wow. Oh, little bees. All these bees in here. Making honey. Well, you can't see very well because of the reflection, guys, but they're all. Cool. Wow, they're making honey. Look at that. Let's see if you can find the queen bee. Can you see it? Do you know you can feel them going through if you're really careful? They go out there and click. Wow, look at all them, Elliot. Yeah! They're good, aren't they? Yeah! In this room here, we've got a load of like frogs and lizards and turtles and some really cool ones over here. Oh, look. <laughs> Turtles. Look at the side. Oh, look. Look at them. Look at that little baby turtle. Look at these. Wow, Isaac, look at them. Can you see them turtles? Yeah. We've got some bearded dragons in here. Wow, look! What's that? And how many legs on this one? 200. 200. 200 legs on that one? 200 legs. Do you like him? He's good, isn't he? Look at all his legs. Oh, wow, look at them. They're all moving. Yeah. Can you see? Oh, look, it's open it up. <laughs> No, you don't eat it, it's a bug. <laughs> you don't eat it. <laughs> wow. Is that good? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wow, look at them. This one older. Like, just another different species. Ah, right. One of them eat it? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to stroke it, Isaac? You want to stroke it? Go on then. Wow. <laughs> you want to hold the baby one? You want to hold it? Yeah. Yeah, this one? 
Wow, you're gonna hold it, Elliot. Very brave. It looks really nice. Look at that, good boy. Wow. Good boy, Elliot. <laughs> Did it feel funny? Yeah. You take us, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't take us Good boy. Turn your hand round. <laughs> Did it tickle? <laughs> Clever boy. <laughs> wow, they're good, aren't they? Well done! <laughs> wow! Smile, Elliot! Does that feel funny? Right, be careful. She can't feel my Is it like a baby one? <laughs> You'll come stand here a minute, Elliot, and get a picture of Isaac. Oh, it's got a Oh, did that feel funny? Isaac. Like, no, I don't know now. Well done. That guy who was just with was a really big help. He let the kids hold some insects and he, he talked about them with us. It was just a really nice thing for him to do and he spoke English to us all the way through as well, which was really appreciative because obviously we don't know French. It was really nice. It was good to see the bugs up close and personal, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh yeah. It was really nice. And stroke them and touch them. And then now is we've, we've come round to the back a bit, just seeing the rest of the butterflies. We didn't realise they had a butterfly bit here as well. So, so we're just looking at all the butterflies again. Some really nice ones. Oh, there, look, can you see? Woo! <laughs> There's just butterflies everywhere flying. Oh, there. It's a nice butterfly. Hi guys, so we were going to go to the beach after we came back from the bug place and the mechanical place. It is a lot later on. We got back about 3 o'clock and it's now about 7 o'clock. We decided, well, the boys decided they wanted to go for another swim in the swimming pool. I didn't bother vlogging or taking the GoPro just because we've been to the beach, uh, not the beach, the swimming pool every single day since we've been here and I thought there's no point putting some more swimming pool footage into the vlog. So John's just nipped down to the restaurant that's here on site to go and get us a couple of pizzas and then I think we're going to sit outside and eat our tea and then uh, maybe go explore one of the new beaches that we've not been to yet. Which should be good. Oh! The back! Hi! Hi! Ooh, pizza's here. It looks yummy. Yummy, yummy. Does it look nice? Yeah. Yeah? You can have some yummy pizza? Yeah. Mmm, delicious. Um, Barbies. Mmm, <laughs> that looks like yummy pizza. Is it nice? Is that yummy? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Is yours yummy? Yes. Have you cheered up now from all your crying? Yeah. Yeah. Um, now Dad is back. Mm -hmm. Oh look, he's fallen, he's scraped his, uh, his, his leg, let's have a look at your arm, his arm, his knee somewhere, are you alright? Yeah. Yeah, do you need a plaster? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he's silly, he's riding his bike all the way down the hill and fell. Yeah, that, twice now. You gotta listen up, listen up There's not a thing that I can get from you Boy, I don't need that much, need that much How can I tell 
well, it's bedtime and um, Sam is just reading the kids a story. And this, I love, I love when Sammy reads the kids a story. Let's go see what she's reading. Mike was determined to study hard and ace his final exam. Meanwhile, all Sully did was mess around. He thought that being big and having a loud roar were enough to make him the best scarer. During the final exam, Mike and Sully got him into roaring, got into a roaring face-off. They accidentally broke Dean, Head Scrabble's prize scream can. Head Scrabble continued giving Mike and Sully the exam. Then she decided that neither of them would be staying in the scaring programme. Oh no. <gasps> Winning the annual scare game was Mike and Sully's only way of getting back into the scaring programme. To complete in the games they had to join a fraternity. Uzma Kappa, the members of OK, were Don, Squishy, Art and Terry and Terry. Mike wasn't happy about working with Sully, but he had no choice.